the, the winners in the past. Yeah, the, sorry. Tell us about the feature of this year's tower run. Okay, the feature about the tower run itself is again the three races. There's the individual category where one person runs all five buildings. Then there's a team category where a team of five is spread out between the five buildings. There's a waiting pass. One person runs one building. In that uh, category, we've got corporate teams. We've got institutions and groups. Institutions group com comprise of the police, the navy, the lifeguards, the anti-terrorist squad, etc. And we've got the student category, which comprises of colleges and HSC students, etc. Then we also have at the end of it a one building race, which we call a vertical sprint. That's just one building. That's at the end. It's a fun thing. It's where people who don't want to necessarily take it too seriously just run up one building. That's right at the end of the event. Which are the buildings? Uh, it starts at, okay, the event is at Gerard Imperium 2 in the Pato complex. That's the first building. So it goes from Gera 2 to Gera 1 to Kamat to Dempo Trade Center. Dempo Trade Center has run twice. And how many, so how many floors, uh, stairs right. and all? So there's totally 840 steps. Oh. 35 floors, 840 steps up and down. Huh? So it's a combination of, it's like Correct. 840 steps up, 840 steps down. So totally 35 floors, 5 buildings, 7 floors each. So that's the entire distance that they run. Any cash prize or something? There are cash prizes in uh, all the categories except the corporate. There's cash prizes in the individual students and uh, all, the other, all the other categories. And uh, there are other prizes which have been given to us, which are Akron, the Akron Hotel group has given us some prizes, which are room nights. There are prizes given by Norbert's uh, Fitness Studio. And uh, Crown Hotel has also given us, Crown, is, Crown Hotel is taking care of the cash prizes. How it has been in the last few years, uh, this event, has it gained popularity? And what has been the number, number as far as participants, has it increased or what it is? Right. So in the first year, we had about 100 to 125 participants. Last year, we had close to 300. So it's been growing steadily. Now, tower running is not a sport where you can, where the number of participants can grow uh, to unlimited numbers because it's also governed by the the size of the building and the stairwells. So you, I mean, we don't compare it to. Uh, marathon where you can have 10,000 participants because it's not possible to you'll be running the whole day you know we have to release them one if the tower runners are released one at a time so we you know restricted to about eventually probably 500 600 participants oh. yeah eventually it'll we, we wouldn't want it to go above that so then we'll have to close it you know close entries after it reaches a certain number you have already because the numbers are restricted uh, governed by also the entrance to the building, stairwells okay. are narrow, so you can't have thousands of people running up and down. Already you have received, you started to receive participant entries or something? Yes, we have. Entries have already come in. The entries close on the 5th of Janu uh, Jan uh, February. 5th of February is the last day for registration. Most of the entries have come in. There are a few which will be now coming in in the next few days.